Insiders. Yes, I know the last video I uploaded was supposed to end off in the year 2020, this horrible shit year, and it gets even worse because what caught my attention being Mini Lad made another apology video. So what, clearing the air wasn't an apology? It was more just a bullshit artist like you. This is a bullshit video. So Mini Lad mentioned that he wants to be transparent with his audience about what he did with two girls named Haley and Ash by sending inappropriate texts and sending nudes to these girls who were 16 and 17 at the time. And I did two videos on it. Go check them out in the description below and it should tell you more about this guy. Everyone's going on about the messages he sent and that could be really creepy, but that doesn't really held up to what the bigger picture was, is that uh, there's something more to that and he mentioned it more and more. By the way, nobody really cared if you try to kill yourself when you were depressed by talking to kids. Get a grip. So he starts off a video by apologizing to these girls about sending inappropriate texts and him just going through a really tough time. Looking for sympathy. I'm not looking for anything. This is not what this is about. This is telling you guys the reason. And I just want you to understand the headspace that I was in. <laughs> the headspace that I was in. <laughs> the headspace that I was in. <laughs> the headspace that I was in. I was in under dread headspace. I was not in the good headspace. I was not in the good headspace. I was not in the good headspace. I know you say that people don't want to sympathize with you, but it's pretty clear what you're trying to do here, Craig. All right? Yeah, well, the reason why it's taken me so long to make this video is I was scared. Pretty early on, I wasn't okay. That's the reason why I went back to Northern Ireland, not to flee charges. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Wait. So you weren't fleeing the country just to not get away from the fact that you sent your cock to two minors. What? Craig, YouTube is your life. You said it yourself. You've been doing it for 10 years, ever since you were a teenager. Now you're an adult. You gotta pay the consequences for what you did. S sending inappropriate texts, that's not gonna clear up in court, but what Will did was the news that you sent. Now, that's something that you have to look in the mirror and ask yourself, Cred, wow, I can't believe what I did. Yeah, you did do that. And that's something that you have to remember for the rest of your life. No comments are gonna ever make you feel better without you making yourself feel better by being a little bit of a man and doing what you have to do. There may be bits and pieces that I missed, and for that I apologize. Uh, I, I left bits and pieces. I, I, I don't know what I'm talking about. The bits and pieces are really the most important part you should have said. Like, uh, again, sending your dick to kids. So if you want to be transparent, cred, maybe that's what you should have started off with. But well, your PR team sent you some really good advice by not revealing that in the video because it makes you look bad. Somebody that was watching, Yo ass is about to be on lockdown, homie. And, and that's not something that anybody would fuck with. So in conclusion, this is all damage control for him due to his channel dying and he can't move on without thinking about it. And he had to make that video and being transparent when you left a lot of things out. But anyways, guys, that's it for the video. Um, probably the last one, I, for sure, of 2020. I hope to see you in the near future in 2021 to create content. Peace.